Hello, happy Gib Sunday. Today I want to do a compare and contrast uh, between a couple petals that I have here. Uh, I wanted to look at Spring Reaver in particular. Uh, so I just got the Digitech Hardwire RV7, uh, mostly for the reverse function that it has, but I noticed that it has a really nice sounding spring reverb. And I wanted to compare that to my old standby that I've loved for quite a while, Robert Keeley's Caverns, um, which uh, I've been using pretty much since my main amp doesn't have a reverb built into it. Although I do have a little secondary amp, a Swart, that does have spring reverb in it. So I wanted to just check and see uh, what Peanut Gallery has to think about the two sounds that we're going to dial in there and then maybe compare them against a third of the real reverb. Uh, this morning we've been jamming through my Gibson ES-137 that I outfitted with Bigsby and a couple of TV Joneses. Um, and just so I have both hands free, I'm using a loop station just so that I don't have to sit there and try and dial all this in with my feet. So let's see what happens. And first, we're going to start out listening to what the normal sound is without any reverb at all. That's, uh, that's what I've got for right now. Uh, they both sound really good. Um, it's a bit hard to decide. It's different from actual real spring reverb, but you know, what's real versus what's digital and all the other modeling stuff. But 
Let me know what you think uh, in the comments down below if you have an opinion on them or if you want to see me try and shoot out some of the other pedals that I've got going on here. So anyway, uh, have a good Gibbs Sunday and enjoy jamming out. Bye.